I've been working as a chief engineer on super yachts for the last 10 years, but my dream was always to sail my own sailboat around the world. In September 2017, a hurricane called Irma wiped out part of the Caribbean. It was the largest hurricane in Atlantic history. Thousands of boats were completely destroyed. Although absolutely devastating for the country, I knew something had to be done with all of the boats. I found a Lagoon 450 which had sunk on one side and had holes all through it. The insurance company said it was a constructive total loss. People said I was crazy, but I knew we could bring her back to life. Days without water along the sun so road. We crossed over borders to get where we are. Don't film me crowbarring. We fixed the boat in the water just enough for us to sail out of Tortola and we went to Rio Dulce in Guatemala. Here we hauled the boat out to do the repairs properly. We found metres and metres of rotten balsa coral, which all had to be ripped out and replaced. It was the hardest five months of our lives. It was a real test of our character in the Guatemalan heat. Really demoralising. Nights without sleeping Cos you fear the night Hopefully we get a good colour match today and then we can spray one side tomorrow. And days without eating Through sheer hard work and determination, we had revived Parley back to her former glory. <laughs> and so we set sail slowly headed for the Pacific Ocean. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we. You only get one shot at life. My dream was to sail around the globe, and that's exactly what we're doing. As the great Mark Twain once said, 20 years from now, you'll be more disappointed by the things you didn't do than by the things you did. So what are you waiting for? Be free with me. <laughs> 